we need to find derivative of cross sec hyperbolic inverse x okay now let's see this is same as if i send this side this is same as cross sec of hyperbolic y is equals to x okay this same as this now differentiating with respect to x differentiating with respect to x okay be careful over here we have y over here okay but we are differentiating with respect to x now differentiating differentiation of cos hyperbolic is what minus cot of hyperbolic y into cos of hyperbolic y is equals to what divide dx of x is what 1 okay into okay since differentiating with respect to x is what into we have y so dy upon dx equals to 1 is implies dy upon dx is equals to here i can say minus 1 i am sending over here upon cot of hyperbolic y here cos sec of hyperbolic y okay now what is cos hyperbolic y is what this cos hyperbolic is we have this we have x because over here this is x same over here okay but we need to find cot hyperbolic y okay but we have cot hyper, hyperbolic y is what we have this okay we have cot hyperbolic square x equals to minus 1 equals to cos hyperbolic square okay now we want to find cot okay therefore cot of hyperbolic square x is equals to we have cosec hyperbolic square x plus 1 okay cosec cosec is what we have x okay this same as will be x square since cosec hyperbolic is what cosec hyperbolic y is what okay this will be what x okay instead of y you can write x you can write y y over here okay angles are same x square plus 1 therefore cot of hyperbolic y okay we want only cot hyperbolic y squaring on both sides taking square root on both sides we have x square plus 1 why square root because i want to remove this you can say cot of hyperbolic square y after that taking square root on both sides square root and square gate cancel we have cot of hyperbolic y and we have this okay so therefore instead of this i can write x square plus 1 therefore minus 1 upon x into square root of x square plus 1 okay this is what this is uh, derivative of cosec hyperbolic inverse x okay